Charlie Parsons for Boxing Social in association with William Hill and Empire Fight Store. My style is this. Frank, I'm fuming. What happened there, mate? I'm absolutely livid. What happened? Because you were all talk, you were like, well, let's set off slow and then I'm really going to, I'm going to burn out the last 4K. And you burnt, you literally burnt out. It's quite embarrassing, really. I am so dehydrated. There is no moisture. I don't know what's going on here. I was sorting out the camera. I can see you fine, mate. Um, yeah, wasn't there today. You beat me. Credit where credit's due. My Strava says 23.40. Well, it's obviously broke, isn't it? Do you know what the worst thing is? All the training sessions that you've posted? Yeah, but last night ruined everything. Do you know what I was doing last night? I had a few glasses of red wine. I had a beer. I had a curry. And am I here? I woke up to a Domino's uneaten. That's not my problem. You've got to start making the right decisions in life, Parsons. That's the reality here. You know, you're in an unbelievable position, but I think it's going to your head. Nights out on a Friday like that before show night. I never do that, but the Sirencester boys are in London. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter that the Sirencester boys are here. Sirencester boys can come to London any day with you, so don't blame them. Don't blame the Siren Sister boys for your lack of ability to win the race. You can't, you bring your mates here and then you're blaming them that you got beat. It's actually quite embarrassing. The only person you can blame is yourself. You know, these guys, they did it in 22 and a half minutes. I saw them, they were off. And where were you? Oh, I had an uneaten Domino's. Embarrassing, mate. Um, I have been absolutely violated. Anyway, Joshua Hellenius, tonight, Excited, frankincense. I'm buzzing, mate. Oh, oh. There was that was coming in. There was a yeah. bit of abuse from Siren Sester coming in. <laughs> uh, buzzing, mate. Can't wait. Big show, big heavyweight nights, big knockouts, live on the zone. All part of your subscription. Don't miss it. What did you think of the face-off yesterday? Uh, interesting. I, that, I, I couldn't. I could just see the two of them having a little chat. But you must have watched it back of what words were said. Bits of it, but I. I, have, uh, I was on the phone a lot yesterday. Yeah, so. so important. No, I'm not important. But I just, I don't, I don't look at social media a lot. Your spat with Simon Jordan, little reaction? It wasn't really a spat, was it? No, but I'm here for clickbait, Frank. Oh, my spat with Simon Jordan, he threw a right hand, I got out of the way and I went uppercut. And Punched the mic and all. No, but he, um, he said, so we should have grown up conversations. But he said we should have grown-up conversations, yet he calls me a goblin and a tea boy every day. So I'm a bit confused which one, he, which route he wants to go down. But me and Simon Jordan, I think we might go on holiday together. I think we get on quite well, actually. What are your thoughts on that, if they go on holiday together? Can I pan the camera to you? No? Is Frank allowed to go on holiday with Simon Jordan? I don't think he'd want to. Oh. No, I think he'd be great company. <laughs> Frank, I will leave it at that. You've killed me. I'm gutted. See you later. You killed yourself, Parsons. You've got to start making the right decisions.